I'm Christy Rost, and I'm here at one of Dallas's premier food and wine events, Savor Dallas. I'm here with Rob with Glenn Fittich, and um, this is a single malt scotch. Single malt scotch, yes, it's from Speyside, Scotland, and it's just basically three ingredients. It's water, barley, and yeast, and it's just aged in different casks, and that's where it pulls the flavoring from. And tell me, describe the area where this is produced. Yes, it's about 150 miles north of Edinburgh on the northeast part of Scotland. It's called Speyside and it's in a valley area and there's a river, the river Spey actually goes through the bottom of that valley and that's where the, we, uh, the distillery gets the water from for the, for the actual whiskey. So it's from there and it's a real remote area. And it has a lot of wildlife and sheep and beautiful valleys. Valleys, and all. exactly. That's where we get the name from actually on here. You can see the deer and you've got Glen which is valley, Finnick which is deer, Valley of the Deer. There's a lot of wildlife in there, and that's why we have the uh, the deer's head on the bones. I was fascinated to know that Glen Fittich is still family owned. Yes, it is. It's about seven generations, and uh, the bobbins have been bought out about probably four or five times now. And each time they said no, the family said no. We want to keep it traditional, family owned, and that, you know it's going really well at the moment. So. Oh, I think that's wonderful. And I've been in that area. It is gloriously beautiful. I love. Scotland anyway. I would love to try the 18 year. I, try, I started with the smooth and it's time to step up. So, uh, okay, so we'll get you an 18. Okay. Right. Here we go. There we go. Just like wine, it's wonderful to be able to compare the various years and the various vintages, so to speak. They're all very unique flavorings as well. I mean, the 15 is a very different flavor to the 18. The 15 is a very warm, spice, good flavoring, and the 18 is a little bit more baked apple with a little bit more extra bite to it. I love this. And this is the style that yes. I prefer anyway, but you can taste the terroir. And that's why I mentioned about the, the surroundings, the fields and the grasses right, right. and all, because you can taste that. Yeah, it's, it's a very, it's a very, dry, it's a bit drier than the uh, scotch on the west side, simply because of the weather. The, the, there's a lot more rain and, you know, dense heat. So the, the scotch is on the west side of Scotland. are a lot heavier, yes. peaty, smoky. Right, exactly. And where this is from on the northeast, it's a little drier. So it's a little, they're not quite as harsh and smoky, and just very good scotches in general. So. Rob, it has been a pleasure. Thank you, Thank you so Thank much you. for Thank being you. here at Savor Dallas.